Here's a sea ox eye daisy. And uh, as the name implies, it is in the daisy family, or Asteraceae. And the Latin on it is uh, Barichia frutescens. And there's a little shot there with some of the emerging flowers. There's also a Barichia arborescence around here, but you don't see it as often. Uh, but these, the uh, frutescens and the arborescens are two of the more um, woody forms of daisies that can be found in the state. Uh, and there's there are things in the daisy family that can be huge trees too, which is kind of funny when most daisies are just these little petite things that grow on the ground and and a lot of them are annuals. But uh, this one I believe stays perennial. Um, I don't ever see big die-offs on the plants, so it's an extremely salt tolerant plant. If you live in a high salt zone, which is kind of where this is, there's a brackish estuary right there. Uh, this is a choice plant. Gives you color. Uh, the, even, the, even the leaves are nice. They're kind of bluish or not quite blue, but sort of a silvery glaucousy color. So, uh, Sea Oxide Daisy and it's Barichia frutescens, and it's certainly a worthwhile thing to have in your landscape if you have the right uh, conditions for it.